Mac crawling series is a polynomial approximate a function about a point that is x equal to zero. This expansion is determined by the derivative of the function at the point which it is approximated around x equal to zero. Using the McCoring theorem to get the expansion of the function f of x, we have a polynomial function f of x we call equation a non a1 a2 and so on when x equal to 0 we have f of 0 equal to a non then we try to find the first derivative f prime x so we get f prime x equal to a1 plus 2a 2x plus 3a 3x squared and so on when x equal to 0, we get f prime 0 equal to a1. Then we continue to get the f prime second derivative f prime prime x. So we get 2a2 plus 6a3x plus 12a4x squared and so on. When x equal to 0, our second derivative f prime prime 0 equal to 2a2. Then continue, we go to the Third derivative f prime prime x we have the 6a3 plus 24a4x and so on when x equal to 0 we have the third derivative f prime prime 0 equal to 6a3 then we continue to the fourth derivative equal to 24a4 when x equal to 0 our fourth derivative f4 0 equal to 24a 4 and so on so we substitute the coefficient a0 a1 a2 a3 a4 in the polynomial function so we get the macroring series f of x equal to f of 0 plus f prime 0 over 1 factorial x plus f prime prime 0 over 2 factorial x square plus f prime 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 0 over 3 factorial x cube and so on. We go to example 1. Let's say we have the f of x equal to e rise of power x. So we differentiate the function with respect to x to obtain f prime x equal to e raised to the power x. Then we continue to find the second derivative f prime prime x equal to e raised to the power x. Then we continue to find the third derivative, fourth der derivative, and fifth derivative. All get the same answer e raised to the power of x. Now we substitute the x equal to 0 to the function and the derivative we found. So f of 0 equal to e raised to the power of 0 equal to 1. So same as f prime 0 second derivative f prime prime 0 until f phi 0 equal to e rise of power 0 equal to 1. We using the Macroring theorem to solve to get the expansion of the f of x. So after we substitute the f of 0, f prime 0, f prime prime 0 into the equation equal to 1, we get our answer equal to 1 plus x plus 102x squared plus 106x cubed and so on. Step the Macroring series for e rise of power negative 2x up to the term in x to the power 3. We use the standard series e rise of power x equal to 1 plus x plus 1 over 2x squared plus 1 over 6 x to the power 3 and keep going to higher power of x. 
to obtain the solution for e raised to the power of negative 2x, we just convert the e raised to the power of x to e raised to the power of negative 2x. Then we get the expansion for e raised to the power of negative 2x equal to 1. Convert the x equal to negative 2x. Now become bracket negative 2x plus 1 over 2 negative 2x squared plus 1 over 6 bracket negative 2x to the power 3 and keep going to higher power of x. Then we do simplify. We get final solution for the expansion e raised to the power 2x equal to 1 minus 2x plus 2x squared minus 4 over 3x to the power 3 and keep going to higher power of x. Now we're going to example 2. If y equal to 10x, show that dy over dx equal to 1 plus y square, obtain the Macroring series for 10x up to the term in x to the power of 3. Given y equal to 10x, we differentiate the equation or the function with respect to x, we obtain first derivative dy over dx equal to 6 square x. Recall back to the trigonometry identities. Sine square x plus cos square x equal to 1. We divide all the terms with cos square x. Then we simplify the equation. We obtain 10 square x plus 1 equal to 6 square x. We convert 6 square x equal to 1 plus tangent square x. As we know, given by the question y equal to 10 x, so tangent square x equal to y square. Now we have the new equation dy over dx equal to 1 plus y square. We change it to y because differentiate with y with respect to x is more easier compared to trigonometric function tangent square x. Continue our working solution to find the second derivative. So we differentiate the first derivative with respect to x. We get second derivative 2 square y over dx square equal to differentiate 1, we get 0. Differentiate y square, we get 2y. Then differentiate y with respect to x, we get dy over dx. Then we continue with the next step to get the third derivative. Differentiate the second derivative, we get third derivative equal to, for our right side, we apply the product rule to solve. Our u equal to 2y, v equal to dy dx. So we have d2y. Then differentiate the first derivative, we get second derivative d square y over dx square plus now differentiate the 2y. We get 2, then differentiate the y, we get dy dx. Then we do simplify, we get the our solution for the third derivative equal to 2y. Second derivative d square y over dx square plus 2 bracket dy over dx square. We're using Macroring theorem central at x equal to 0 to get the expansion of 10x. So when x equal to 0, f of 0 is 0. 
So we go to the substitute zero into the express expression we obtained before. First derivative, second derivative, and third derivative when x equals to zero, we get first derivative equal to one. Second derivative, we get zero. Third derivative, we get two. <clears throat> then we compare to the formula of Macquarie theorem. So expansion to ten x equal to f of zero equal to zero. Apply zero, we get one. So we have one over one factorial multiplied with x to get x. Then second derivative of zero, we get zero over two factorial we still get zero for x square. Plus third derivative of zero over three factorial. Third derivative of zero equal to two. Two over three factorial we get six. So final we have the expansion ten x equal to x plus one over three x to the power of three and keep going to the higher power of x. Find the first three non-zero terms of the series expansion of e rise of power negative 2x multiplied with tangent x. To obtain the expansion of e rise of power negative 2x multiplied with 10x, so we just multiply the expansion of e rise to the power of 2x, negative 2x, and the expansion of 10x. We just solve until x to the power of 3. So after do the working solution, we get the expansion of the x rise of power of 2x multiplied with 10x equal to x minus 2x squared plus 7 over 3 multiplied with x to the power of 3 and keep going to the higher power of x. Exercise If y equal to e rise of power of x multiplied with sine x show that d square y over d x square equal to 2 dy over dx minus 2y. Hence, using the Macquarie theorem, find the Macquarie series for e to the power x multiplied with sine x up to and including the term in x to the power 3. Deduce the Macquarie series for e to the power x multiplied with cos x up to and including the term in x to the power of 3.